A newspaper comic is turning heads in Putnam County tonight. Tuesday's printing of the Palatka Daily News features a comic of a shark reading a sign in the ocean that says, warning, go near shore at own risk, angry white males with easy access to guns. News 4 Jackson reporter Maggie Lorenz is live in Palatka. And Maggie, this printing comes just days after what a weekend, a violent weekend of mass shootings. Right, Joy, and I have in my hands here a copy of Tuesday's paper. It's getting a lot of buzz now with that cartoon on the top of page four. I walked around today and talked to people about their thoughts. My reaction is what kind of mess? What kind of I'm just I'm I'm just that's black. In a black and white comic, some people are seeing red. They don't have any respect. They they print what they want to print and they say what they want to say. That's disrespectful. The cartoon was printed days following the mass shootings in Dayton and El Paso. Ohio. At Walmart, who wants to read something like that? Angry white males with guns. Like, that's ridiculous. Yeah. How that's long why I don't even pay for that paper. I don't read that. It's in poor taste. Um, especially given the current climate uh, within our society, I, I think that when I initially see this, it reverts right back to that fairly quickly. And I think that um, this type of um, caricature is not, uh, I think, needed at this moment in time. Another man we talked to had issue with the word white. Seems a little bit racist, yeah. The artist is named Joe Heller, who's based out of Wisconsin and sells his comics to newspapers across the country. We tried asking Palatka Daily News who chooses the comics that run, but we're told no one was available for comment. The publisher was out of the office, but another employee just told me in casual conversation that he also feels that this cartoon was in bad taste. We checked and the artist, Joe Heller, his work is frequently featured in previous editions of the Palaka newspaper. Live in Palaka, Maggie Lorenz, Channel 4, the local station.